Hello there, Mr. Man. How are you today? Pa pow. Why ya pow? Hello, everybody, and welcome to another exciting episode of all. Look at the camera, you bum. My name is Banana Man, also known as you bum in this game, and we are playing the Windbreaker yet again. This is a game that I love so very much, so I just had to play it again because it's been a while since I played it, and I really enjoy playing this game, as you all know, so I apologize if you didn't want to see any more of this, but you're gonna see some more of this because I don't remember the last time I played it. And I don't even remember what we were doing at this point. Was I supposed to leave this island? Did I complete the mission that I was supposed to complete here? I don't know. Oh, look at the gamepad. That's why. I don't think I completed it because... No, because there was still so much I needed to do. I hadn't even beat the boss on this one. I know how to beat the boss on this one, but I hadn't gotten around to it. So that's what we're going to do today. We are going to make our way through a little bit more of the gameplay on this game. We're going to beat the boss of this place, which is that giant... Well, I won't spoil it for you in case you haven't ever seen this before. But I'm sure most of you who have any like, like these series of games at all would probably have known about this boss. But we're going to do it. And we're going to have a lot of fun along the way just because our little Link Man is just too fantastic. Just set that bomb down there and, hmm, something's gonna... Oh, did you smell that? Smells like destiny. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do our best and be fantastic at this. We got Mr. Birdman, the mailman from the very first episode. He's like, I've been waiting for you. You bum, is that you? If it is, I am so pleased to see you are okay. I must say, you've traveled far for one with no wings. And your sister, is she dead? Well, maybe. Hmm, is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there, even though she's kind of dead. I have an idea, you bum. Would you like to meet our chieftain? Sure, I love meeting people. I'm certain that the chieftain will befriend you and lend you the aid of our... Our... Hmm. I'll settle then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone else know you're coming. Come inside, you bum. I'll be waiting. Wee, I'm a bird. And then he goes flying off into the sky, up towards the mountain. When he could have just taken us with him, but he's fat and lazy and he doesn't want to carry me, even though I'm just a little kid. My goodness, what's your problem, man? I weigh like two pounds. Anyway, I guess I can walk. I've come this far after all. And there's a, hmm, lots of bird people. He's like, please come down. You're flying too much and it's making you look strange. Even though we all have beaks. Ah, so you are, you bum, are you? Quill has told me about you. You know, the guy that you sew things with. Wait, no, sorry. Like a porcupine quill is what I meant to say. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. When you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon breached, perched atop the mountain? Uh, as you can see, we have the Rito tribe profoundly connected to the sky. We wear beaks on our faces, and our ears are long. Our eyes are red, except for mine, which are yellowish-orange. But everybody else's is red, so you should always remember that. If it continues, then the dragon will be angry, and he will burn your face. And then everybody will laugh. Okay. Chieftain, what do you think regarding your son? Your son is a guy and he has something to give you, bum. That may be. Uh, but I'm too old to care about it. So you should just do whatever you want. What say you? Will you share some of your courage? Will you meet with my son? Well, sure. I love meeting people. I thank you. And then, yeah, I have something I wish you to give me. My son, a young girl named Medley. I'm counting on you. Wait. You want me to give your son a girl named Medley? Here, your bun, take this with you. Who knows, it might come in handy. <gasps> it's a bag! I love bags. I've already got three. You should find Medley in one of the upper rooms. Leave the great value to us and Prince Comelli. I'm a bird! Okay, cool. So that's out of the way. We got talking to those people. They told me lots of valuable information. I got a bag out of it. If I could get a bag for every time I converse with someone, that would be fantastic. Are you the girl I'm supposed to give to the prince? Wow, you really do have green clothes and a strange shaped hat. Hey, 
Well, you got a strange shaped beak, if I may say so myself. Well, to tell the truth, I'm not quite an attendant yet, but I don't really care, so here, take this. Oh, thank you. I got a letter from her father, which is not really her father, it's the old guy's father. The waiting room is back there, and you can talk to him, and then, uh, um, I love you and stuff. I, I want you to come meet me for dinner. We're gonna have spaghetti. No, I don't have time for spaghetti. I'm getting out of here. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to the little boy that's down here in the room. He's got lots of valuable information, except for not too much. He's got something good for me, though. You see this thing that he has for me is right there. I want that thing because it's round and it's glowing and it looks like it has tadpoles on it. So I would like them very much. Or maybe it's someone's hair follicles. Who are you supposed to be? Um... Oh yeah, I'm your I'm your dad's friend. Let me get this letter real quick. Where's the letter? Oh, I'll just put that in my inventory. There we go. Uh, here for you. A letter from my father. <laughs> I love letters. Hmm. But this one's boring, so I don't really care. You you're in this letter too, you know. Picking your nose is other people's business. But I don't feel like going to talk to you because you're ugly and you have a booger for a hat. You probably picked it from your own nose, didn't you? Well, if that was not the most rudest little boy I have ever seen. And I can't even focus the camera on my face because I had the sticks inverted. There we go. But what I was saying is... Oh, wait, wait. Switch to selfie view. What a rude little boy. Oh. No, no, I can't remember how this thing works. Never mind. I'm just going to leave him alone now. Even though he's very rude, I'm just going to have to put up with his antics for a while. So, he won't listen to me. Oh, excuse me, Stairs. I didn't see you there. So, since he doesn't want to talk to me, I'm just going to go have spaghetti with my new girlfriend because she loves me and she makes spaghetti. So... Here we go, excuse me, have you seen a girl that used to be in that room over there, right over there, have you seen her? She was gonna give me spaghetti, oh is it you, hello lady, oh okay, it wasn't her, never mind. Let's go out this way, this might be the way to go. Is this where we, hello, is there spaghetti in these pots? No, but there's money, I'll take it. Thank you much, uh, I'm not seeing any spaghetti over here, but there's a place that I could jump over there. No, I can't jump, I'm too wimpy, never mind, excuse me. Can't jump across giant chasms quite yet. I'm not tall enough. Excuse me, spaghetti girl. Are you around here somewhere? I am sorry for making fun of your beak earlier. I just <gasps> wanted some spaghetti. Ooh. Sir, is it me? Or is it hot in here? Ha, huh? it's probably me. Okay, let's go. Oh, no, I didn't want to talk to you. Excuse me. Don't make me use the sword. I didn't mean to pull it out and scare you like that, but you almost made me use it. I remember I have to go down here and out this, this way, right? I know where I'm going because I've been through this process 13 times before. Here we go. This is not the right way, or is it? Yeah, there it is. Hello, I'm sorry I'm late, but I'm here for the spaghetti. Oh, I'm sorry. I ate all the spaghetti already. You were too slow. Plus, you have a wimpy mouth that could never eat enough spaghetti anyway. But, but I wanted the spaghetti. Oh, that's okay. You can have spaghetti next time. Otherwise, I won't have enough. Oh, toast. Well, I need to ask you this. Can you please join me for some toast? Sure. Whew, thank you so much. I thought you might not like my toast. Wait, pick you up and throw you. Okay. This is a strange way to eat toast, but if that's what you want, then I'll just pick you up and throw you. Can we have toast now? Is it time for toast? It is time for toast. Thank you. You have a good day. Okay. You didn't exactly work. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, here we go. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna stand on this ledge here. All right, you ready for this? The winds are in our favor, so go, go, soar. Wait, she grew wings for a second there. Oh, thank you. I know I could climb something. Don't worry, I'll be fine. There's something to b b b b bursting with confidence. If anything happens to me, then tell everyone I died. 
Okay. Oh, she's gonna give me a present. It's spaghetti! Oh, wait, no, it's not. No, oh, it's too bad. Well, don't tell anybody that I didn't give you spaghetti, okay? I'll give you toast later. Fine. Uh, let me just get this. Uh, excuse me. Gotta drag my bottle into there. There we go. Swoosh. I got some water. It's so delicious because it's been sitting under this old rock and has lots of ashes falling on it. It's so good for you. Okay, let's climb straight, please. Thank you. I'm just gonna come on up here. Uh, I wish I had something old and withered to throw this water on. Hey, look! Old and withered plants! I'll just dump this here. <gasps> it's so happy now. Now I'm just going to throw it onto that rock and just go boom. There we go. And then the geysers, the whole thing. I sure am glad I saved that rock from its eternal suffering in a puddle of sadness. Those were probably the rock's tears. Now that he has been destroyed, he can live happily ever after as this water fills up the entire world. Okay, here we go. Here we go, gonna save the day. Gonna save that girl, bring her back to the guy so that I can have their toast and everyone will be happy. Okay, let's just open up these pots real quick. Oh, excuse me, I wanted to, oh, there was only one. Only one gem, okay, here we go. Which is too fantastic. Okay, we got dragons. We got things with big noses and giant lips and a strange looking tuft of chest hair, but that's okay. We're gonna pull this out here. There we go. And we're gonna pull this out here. There we go. And we're gonna cut these pots. There's nothing in those pots. What about these pots? There's nothing in any of these pots. That's okay. Hello everybody, it's time to party! Oh, 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 party! And then party, 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 party! Oh, party, party! Spank! Oh, excuse me, oh, excuse me! Oh, excuse me! Oh, there we go, pow! There we go, everybody's happy now, give me this stick, because I gotta light this thing. I go light it like that, and I light it like that, and then we get a treasure chest, because we're fantastic! All right, let's just drop the stick. Open that. Give me your key. Yeah. Okay. Now we're going to jump down here. We're going to fly through the door. Open that door. Get these pots. Pow, pow. Nothing in the, any of these pots. Break that with my face. <gasps> it's a lava pit. If this were realistic conditions, I would have burnt to a crisp many times ago. And I would not even be able to stand at this distance because it would burn me. Way too badly. But since this is a cartoony game, it doesn't matter. Let me just pull this out real quick. And then climb on top. And then make the leap of faith. There we go. Hello, giant spewing lava. How are you today? Whoa, that was a big flaming chunk right there. But I'm not going to really worry. There's also some bats. But, you know, every cave is full of bats. Not an issue. There we go. We got bomb. Toss. Kablooey. Hey, look. What a conveniently placed door. Let's open it, shall we? Oh, goody, goody. Now we're just gonna, oh, I accidentally sat on the lava. That was not my intended desired result, but you know, sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. All right, so we're gonna throw this over there so I can get the treasure. Oh, look, it's a flower. It grew in the middle of the lava. Okay, open up this chest. And this chest is special, because it doesn't just open and give us stuff. It shines glowing wonderfulness. And then we get a map. Oh, boy, I love maps. Too bad I won't be able to read it because I'm not looking at my gamepad much because this microphone's in the way. All right. We're going to jump across here, climb the ladder of justice. Hey, look, it's a jelly. Oh, how dare you, you jelly. Be vanquished. Give me your jelly bits. Oh, he didn't have any jelly bits. That's okay. Up we go. And then we're just gonna break through this wall if we can. Oh, he broke through the wall. Thank you much. Excuse me, but I need to borrow your sword. Thank you much. And I'm just gonna throw it at there. There we go. Hello, everybody. Oh, can I throw it at that one too? Oops, sorry, wrong thing. 
Oh, hi, jellies. Pow. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's just break that. Got some jelly bits. Yeah, like jelly bits. Mm-hmm, so good. Okay, give me your stuff. I got the key. Yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna pick this up again. Excuse me, Mr. Jelly. I know you want to play, but I don't have time to. Goodbye. Yeah, all right. Where are we now? We're right here. Let's throw a pot at that bomb. I missed. Let's throw this pot at that bomb. I didn't miss. Oh. Oh, so pro. I'm so tired, too. Why am I so tired? I'm only half dead. It's not an issue. Let's break some of these, see if there's any hearts inside. There's no hearts inside here. All oh, right, because we're on hero mode. We don't need no stinking hearts. All right. Hello, anybody home? Hi, jelly man. Prepare to be vanquished. What oh, are pow. You got jellified. More jellies. Oh, there are jellies everywhere. Oh, toast. Oh, to pow pow. Oh, there we go. Break through the wall. Oh, it's a guy. It's a guy. I'm gonna vanquish you and take your stick. Because that's my stick. Thank you much. Yeah, pick it up. I got the stick, everybody. No need to worry. Because I am amazing. Okay. Let's light this up. Boom. Toast that burns. <laughs> All right. Push the button. Beep. <gasps> the gate open. Let's go. Do, do, do. And we're back outside. Boy, that was sure easy. Hello there, Mr. Man. How are you today? Pow pow. Why you pow? Ah. <laughs> he fell. He fell through the rock. Okay. Oh, it sounds like somebody left to go there. There. Oh, hi, Mr. Fire. Whoa. Hmm. I see you. Oh, wait. Down is up and up is down. I can climb anything because I'm amazing, man. Oh, oh. It's a bird. Hello, bird. How are you today? Would you like a rock? Because I... Oh, no. Oh. I'm okay. That was a close one, but I'm okay because I'm a professional. You gotta be sure you're always careful with where you walk when you're not being safe. Alright, we're okay. We got this flaming tube of churro. It looks like a churro almost. But I know it's not intended to be. Alright, you bird. Let me do this properly this time. Have a rock. Oh, fine. Don't have a rock. There we go. Alright. I got a feather! It's made of gold! I could sell it on eBay for $25. Okay, now I'm gonna settle my way across here. Hmm. I think there's lava right there. Maybe not. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's spewing all over my back, but I don't mind. Because I'm just so strong, it doesn't even bother me. Okay, here we go. We're gonna climb up on here and just kind of. Oh no, uh, get down, please. I need you to hang on. There we go. Wrong way. There you go. Just gotta slide my way across this place. Because I'm so fantastic. Nothing can stop me. Up we go. Alright. Oh, I almost ran off the edge. But I didn't. I do a lot of things. I almost do a lot of things. But I never do anything because I'm too extreme. Excuse me, Mr. Bombera, but you missed your target. Please try again so that we don't have to fire you from the art department. But chow Whoa. I was supposed to roll off of that, but that wasn't exactly what happened. Here we go. Back inside the cave of doom we go. Yeah. Also, I never noticed this hole before. Where does that go? My map does not say. But that's a pretty cool hole. I never saw that. Okay. Anyway, what we need to do is pull this out here and pull this out here and then we have a happy ending. Okay. Up we go. Up we go. I bet you if we pulled some more of those things, that would probably lead to a little tunnel thing that we could go in. Rats! I don't like them. Uh, excuse me, rats. Please don't take me money. Oh. Somebody's calling me on my cell phone. Have you seen any filthy rats? Oh, only everywhere. Excuse me. Oh, no, please. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to call you filthy. I didn't even call you filthy. He called you filthy. Are you going to take that from him? He's just a boat. Okay. Flume. Prepare to be vanquished. Yeah. 
show that wall who's boss. Give me, oh, give me something. Oh, wait, give me something. It's gonna be a compass because it's shiny. And everybody knows shiny things are always compasses. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Up we go. Up. Open that chest, it's a key. How did I know? Because I'm a genius, that's how. Up we go, we're gonna climb in through here. And up and out, and bada bang. Alrighty, alrighty. We're gonna jump up these stairs. Hello there. Excuse me, Mr. Bird, but you need to go because you sound like an annoying goat. Thank you. Give me a key. Yeah. And then I'm just going to roll on over here. Open the, oops, open the door. And we go. More sticks. Something tells me we're going to need one of these. Boom. It's bats. Burn, you bats. Burn. They don't burn. Run. Run. Just smack all the bats. Okay. There. That's what I thought. Open the chest. Give me another key. Or a butterfly. That's good too. Okay. Oh, I should probably use the torch to burn down this wall. That's probably what it was for. Toast. There we go. Ouch. I can't roll through burning logs. Oh man, I still need that torch. Excuse me, torch. Can I use you for one more thing? Flum. Oh. Nope, I meant to roll, but you can't roll when you're holding a torch. There we go. <gasps> it's a door! Hello, door! Do, 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 do. Just gonna roll my way around here. Make my way through this door right here. <gasps> it's a warthog! No! Prepare to be vanquished, yup! Oh, we both missed so incredibly terribly, but I was the victor anyway. There's more warthogs around here somewhere. Where are y'all at? Not in there. Are you in here? No. What about in here? Nope. What about there? No. There maybe? Maybe there. Or there. There you are. Prepare to be vanquished. Pow. And then Banzai or or Chipow. Hey! You didn't damage me. Why did I take damage? That didn't make any sense. You get spanked for that. Okay. Up we go, I should probably take that. Hey, hey, what part of I should probably take that, didn't you understand? Okay, here we go. We're running out of face cam time. We're running out of video time. I probably should divide this into two episodes, but I thought we would be able to go a lot faster than this. I'm just too slow. All right, we're gonna break this. I'm gonna pick this up, and can I hit that thing with it? I don't know. Yeah, I can because I'm just so cool, but then I can't pick that thing up. That's okay. Cause there's a bad guy in here. Bow. Hey you. Oh my face. Oh snap. Oh snap. You want some of this? No, you don't. Okay, goodbye. Phew, we are on half a heart. I'm gonna die or something. Oh, there goes face cam. Sorry about that. Putting it back on now. And we only got ourselves a few minutes left anyway, so here we go. I want to at least make it to the outside before the face cam dies. It's got to save the girl at least. Okay, here we go. I'm going to place this bomb and place it right there and hopefully not die. Whoa. There we go. We got ourselves a checkpoint. And we go. Hello. Is there anybody here? I was just here. Why did I need to come back this way? That doesn't make much sense. Because I was supposed to go up, not back, that's why. Alright, we'll just roll our way back over here. Come back in. Hopefully there's no more bad guys hiding around, but I don't think there will be. Just make our way up the stairs like so. And in through the door. And then we find ourselves some water buckets. And that terrible centipede of death, which I want to be vanquished. Be vanquished, you evil centipede. Yeah. Why, yeah. Gar, 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 gar. It won't break. There it goes. I jump. Okay. Now we won't have to worry about that centipede for a little bit. So I'm going to place this water right there. Grab another water. Jump across while it's safe. Place the water right there. Jump on it. 
and then ride this thing to the top of the world. Houston, we have the liftoffs. Okay. And out we go. Oh, we're still inside, but we're almost outside. We look over there and admire everything that we can't touch yet. And then we wish we had some bombs. There they are. Okay, we're going to open this one up because this leads to a checkpoint. Kabloom. And then we're going to blow up the one that leads to outside. Do, 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 do. Quick, it's going to blow. Oh! There we go. Excellent. Then we go outside. And we save the spaghetti girl. Here we go. I'm coming for you, spaghetti girl. Everything's gonna be okay. Except for that guy's barfing everywhere. And that's no good. Indiana Jones time. The stairs are falling underneath me. Oh no, run faster. Oh. <laughs> Can you get up? Thank you. There we go. <laughs> oh no. Hoodlums. What are they doing? Uh oh. No, it's not what you think. I'm just a shorty little man. You want to make fun of me because I'm short? Is that what you think I am? I don't think so. Prepare to be vanquished. Yeah. Bonsai. Oh, I missed. But I... Oh, you want some of this, eh? You want some of me? Just take your best shot. Yo, oh, pow, 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 pow. Yeah. Oh, that was so tiring. Oh, no. And then the small big bird dropped a warthog on the land. It's Pumba, and he's here to vanquish us. No, Pumba, no. It's not what you think. I'm just gonna come see if this has any health for me. No health. It's okay, Pumba. It's not what you think. It's not what you think, Pumba. Pumba, no. Pumba, no. Vanquish you. Oh, Pumba. Oh, Pumba. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, oh. Pumba saw me coming. Yeah, Pumba. Pumba, 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 Pumba. No, Pumba. No. Pumba, Pumba, Pumba. Yeah. And that, everybody, is the sad ending of Pumba from the Lion King. He did not turn to his good ways. He instead became a villain and kidnapped Spaghetti Girl. It's a terrible thing that happened. But that's the way it was. And now I'm so tired. I can't even breathe. Oh. Oh. Okay. You bum! You came to rescue me! Oh, thank you. I have to tell you what I found out. This is terrible. Some creature is doing awful things to his tail. Oh, it's so awful. The tail hangs below the room here. There's got to be something in there. One of those mean monsters who captured me had something to do with it. I blame Timon. He was probably behind the entire thing. Here, you bum uses to get out of here because I told you not to follow me. Oh, yeah. I got a grappling hook. So now I can be Batman. Here, you bum. Climb up that ledge so I can show you something. I don't know how she just pulls those wings out of nowhere, but I got a spear out of it, so I'm happy. It's like three times my size. Grab this branch and you can do stuff. Oh, but I got this spear and it's like, look at how big this is compared to me. It's gigantic. Oh, oh well, I'm just going to throw it over there. Oh, it didn't work. Okay, grappling hook. Get it in my inventory. Replace the camera because I don't need it quite right now. Pew! Oh, da, 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 pew! I'm Spider-Man slash Batman slash... Oh, dear. I forgot that this doesn't work like that. Okay, here we go. Push. And swing across. Come down here. Break through it with my awesome face. Oh, I said break. No, okay, fine. Break through it with my awesome sword. Jump down. Whoosh. Roll like a pro. Swing our way across. Being more Batman, Spider-Man, Everman. And then, yep. There you go. I'm just so good at this. They should hire me to be a professional swinger. I'm better than Donkey Kong. Okay. I make my own vines. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the episode right here. When we resume, we will be able to finish up this last bit of stuff and defeat the boss. But as you can see, I'm far too tired to continue any further. So I will catch you all in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. And hello, mother. Where can I help you?
Okay. Um, I'll catch you all in the next episode of whatever it is we are doing. Until then, have a wonderful, fantastic day, and I will see you all later. Okay, bye.